All right, is this recording? I think it's recording. No, it's not recording. Of course, it's recording. And you know why it's recording? Cause I clicked the damn record button. All right, so what's up, guys? Your boy Man at XYZ. So sorry that I left you guys hanging for so long. Um, there's just a lot of stuff going on. Like the other day, I was robbed from my phone. Um, I also got kicked out of my house the other day overnight. Um, I'm back now, of course, but there's a lot of shit going on. So, yeah, please bear with me. Um, and the channel at least, but I plan to get up and running hopefully in another, say like three months or so. <laughs> yeah, because I believe I'm getting a job soon, so that'll help out things with the channel. But, um, anyways, quest Q and A video. I asked you guys to leave comments below asking me whatever you like. It can be about anything. It can be about the games I play. It can be about my life, my personal preference in toothpaste. I don't know anything, you know. So, um, I got the video right over here. Of course, it look a lot different because I'm using. Uh, shittier camera this time, <laughs> and um, I use my grandma's camera. I, I lost the other one. It's my mom's, but don't tell her that. Shh. Anyways, um, so yeah, I'm here reading all the questions. I'll answer them unfiltered, just raw answers. So this is what you guys want to hear. Um, I also made a Facebook post, uh, so I'll go look for that one, of course, right after this. So first off, I want to read these comments. Uh, first question is from Official Quantum Nova. If you had the money and resources to make a game, what would it be? Would it be like SK? Alright, alright. Um, to be honest, if I had the money and resources to buy a game, um, I would definitely buy a car rather than making anything or even considering to make anything like Spiral Knights. Not just joking. <laughs> actually, I actually would make something like Spiral Knights. Spiral Knights is actually a great game. I enjoyed it, even though you were kind of forced or encouraged a lot to buy things all the time, whether it's like energy or... I don't know, just to get those prismatic wings, you know, but to be honest, if I, were, if I actually had um, the money and resources to make a game, I would definitely make something like SK. Um, yeah, it was a great game. I like the idea, like, you know, the, like, the varying puzzles, the multiplayer that you can have, the PvP, the lockdown, the Blast Network, I wasn't so much a fan of, partially because I was kind of shit at Barman, so it kind of applies the same thing as Spiral Knights and um, Blast Network, but yeah, I actually, I actually like it, and I think I would definitely make something... Similar, but of course better, where you're not forced to pay pretty much everything to get, like, far in the game, you know? So, yeah. Next question. This nigga, he put two... This guy asked me two questions in one comment. You're slick. Okay. I said one question. No, I should never said that still. So, again, official Quantum Nova. If you had a lot of, if you had a lot of money to pay free rings to make whatever you want in SK, what will it be? Ooh, man. Damn. I would have to say, um, uh, definitely, definitely add, like, a, some sort of, like, rotisserie grill in the guild hall. Just have some, just put some chicken, oh, man, just have some chicken roasting there in the rotisserie in your guild hall when you're done after a long match of PvP. Just go there. Ah, it's a guild dinner, chicken, okay. But not nah, for real, though, um, I actually wanted to make a weapon. Imagine, imagine them making, like, like a belt or something like that. Like, you know, like, when your mom used to give you, like, an ass open for doing something bad? Just imagine having, like, a belt for PvP. <laughs> That should be pretty jokes, like, I don't know, like, maybe, like, a piercing belt or an elemental belt that does, like, stun or shock, and it's, like, how it works is, like, you're, like, I don't know, using your strike booster or whatnot, and then, like, you stop and you pull out the belt to, like, whip someone from, like, five tiles away. <laughs> okay, I'm crazy, you know what, I should stop before I just start saying some stupid stuff, but okay, uh, definitely either a pissery grill in the guild hall or um, some sort of belt. Just like whip players asses, well, not not literally, but like, you know, it's like, what are you doing or you're talking? Like, <laughs> like 1v1ing, it's like, like you know, like after gym or whatnot, you have like the towels and like, everyone's like on the walls, so like the change room try not to get hit, and like two people go in the middle and just like banging out like, like, like their wet towels, like twirling in this, <laughs> that would be hella jokes, man, that would actually be pretty funny. But yeah, anyways, back to this, uh, why you no work YouTube? Oh, perfect, you're back. Okay, so, next up. Who is this Shadow Kid Gaming getting bright on my channel? He's like, you don't say. Well, you know what? I do say. I, I do say, man. Okay, next up. Let's see. Ooh. I am planning to make a walkthrough video sometime soon. However, I need your option to choose. Oh. So this is from Samhead. Let me read that again. I am planning, planning on to make a walkthrough video sometime soon. However, I need your option on these two choices. The English that he used kind of messed me up because it wasn't written right, so I had to read it over. I'm like, wait, what? So yeah, the two choices are The Legend of Zelda OOT, Ocarina of Time, I believe, or Harvest Moon 64. 
Legend of Zelda. I don't even know what the hell Harvest Moon 64 is. I mean, I know it's probably a Nintendo 64 game, but Ocarina of Time, oh man, oh man, definitely, definitely. There's so much you can comment on, and to be honest, it's just a great game in general, man. Even though, even though it's re really old, I think you can really bring it back to life. You like start with the older games, perhaps even do like the entire Zelda series, man. Like even if you can use like an emulator on the on your computer, or whatnot, you can play through the DS versions and whatnot. I think you can really make a good Zelda-based channel if you really well, Zelda-based channel. I don't think so. Not Zelda-based channel, but yeah, Ocarina of Time, hands down, definitely, definitely. <laughs> Next question. Ben Finnick, Q and A. What is your favorite bomb in SK? Oh man, that's a tough question. But to be honest, ooh, the Ash of Agony is a really nice bomb. I remember when I was doing that Ice Queen Shadow there solo, and I just wrecked absolutely everything just by spamming that bomb. But for aesthetics, the Dark Briar Barrage that looks just totally sexy. If ever, oh my god, like, like it explodes, and on high graphics, all of course all the quills come out, but then you see like, the Snarble Axe just like pop out. And like black and gray, I'm like, bruh. If those were like, if that color was on a pair of Jordans, man, I'll be buying that. Damn. So yeah, I have to say, Dark Briar Barrage is my favorite. Is my favorite bomb in SK. Just, just cause of the looks, but it also does some good damage, man. If you're going in like, you know, Nature of the Beast or even in FSC, man, it just, it does some great damage. It's really good for crowd control. Kind of crowd control. I mean, the metronome or you know, um, Iron Tech would be a bit better for crowd control. Big angry bomb, but definitely Dark Briar Barrage. Plain and simple. Oh, I like Sean Vortex. Oh man, when I when I rolled that CTR high, I'm thinking about it. I remember I trolled a lot of people with my electron vortex in in lockdown. I remember I'm just like just spamming the bomb everywhere. People are just like strike boosting and going in, and then they get stuck right, and they're wasting all this strike booster while being like strolled around the electron vortex, and then they like run out of booster right, and then after that like the bomb explodes and they get shot. And I just come in and just wreck them, boom boom, and they're like, Mimi, what the hell? So. For trolling, oh, that's not Vortex, but in general, still, Dark Briar Barrage. But then we'll take Tempest, don't like, <clears throat> screw it, Dark Briar Barrage, next question. <laughs> okay, next question is, Nate Wabomba. Hmm, if you could own any game in the world, what game would it be? Well, I tend to get kind of could own any game in the world, I mean, it, I don't know if I buy it online, or if someone has it, and I just pay them money over eBay and they ship it to me, like, but... If I could own any game in the world, uh, I, I don't know, like, I really I really want the game Evolve, just because I've seen a lot about it. Um, I don't have a system to play it on, though, of course, but even if I had the game, at least I would, at least when I make my system, I would have something to play it on. So definitely Evolve, it looks really sick. Um, I've already seen some gameplay of it. So, yeah, I mean, I've already played Battlefield Hardline already on the beta. So I kind of know what that's about. It was only like Blood Money and The Heist. So I only played those two modes on it, but it's really good. Um, Battlefield Hardline, I could, but Evolve is still number one. If not Evolve, then Battlefield Hardline, definitely. Um, oh, but Advanced Warfare. Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. I was playing that at my, at my not even friends, more like ex-friend's house, because he's not my friend anymore, really, after he did some dumb shit. But anyways, yeah, he had like a 3D television. Um, it was like 4K TV, 3D, man, and we were stoned this shit, <laughs> and he's just going around, just like shooting things in 3D, you put the glasses on, you're like, bro, but, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of damn good games out there, oh my gosh, I don't know, I don't know, I never played Evolve, so, I would have to say Evolve, just I'm curious, you know, it looks good, so next question, Cheese Pie, if you had no penis for a day, I'm not even bullshitting you guys. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not even BSing you guys. You gotta look at this for yourself. Let me. Let me check. I'm not. I'm not joking. Um, is it gonna focus or not? Nah? I don't know. But yeah, Cheese Pie just asked if you had no penis for a day, bro. If I had no penis for a day, I would die. First off, where am I gonna pee from, man? What? What? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have like a hole right here. I'm just like, what am I gonna do? Like, just sit on top of the toilet like this and just go like, oh. Oh shit, you know what? I'm not even trying to demonstrate that. That is a dangerous to that's danger to my health right now. Um but yeah, if I had no penis, bro, for a day, that would suck. First off I had a girl come over and she wants to get it on, I'll be like, Oh I'm sorry, hon, but we gonna have to, you know, result to the alternative methods, you know. Um, no, no, it's not working like that, bro. That's not a question. I am not living a day without a dick. I'm sorry. It's just how it is. Next question. For oh no. 
What is your favorite Pokemon? Because mine is Infernape, of course, and this is from Infernape88. Oh, my favorite Pokemon. Damn. I love Articuno. Yeah, I might not look like it, but Articuno is my favorite Pokemon. Um, it, it just looks so majestic, and it's really a great special wall. I mean, if you play competitively, I know I used to a lot. I just used to, like, just totally destroy teams. Not even like with brute damage, just with like stalling them out with like Toxic and Roost and like I don't know if you guys like know what I'm saying because not all of you guys are competitive Pokemon players, but for the looks, Articuno, for the strategy, Articuno, um, and it's just freaking badass. You can also learn a one hit KO move, Sheer Cold, which is just pretty, pretty sick even though it doesn't hit like more than half the time. If it does, it's like, what the fuck, you just old cold my Pokemon, like, Articuno's really badass, so... Let me, let me pull up a let me pull up a picture of Articuno for you guys, just in case if you don't know what or who it is. I want to refer to Articuno as an it because it's genderless, but um, it's it's one of the legendary birds, the trio. We got Maltrace, Zapdos, and Articuno. What's a good one that you guys would most likely recognize? This is fan art though, um, but it's still this is a really really traditional drawing kind of. That's Articuno. Let me just check on the camera preview if it really shows well. Yeah, it's an ice it's an ice flying type, it's four times weak to rock, but yeah, I just love that Pokemon, it's great. So let me just go back to YouTube, view the comments, and next question. Wait, scroll down. Scroll, okay. Um Lumpy Rumpman. Okay, for the QA, when did you join SK? I joined back in early twenty I think it was twenty twelve. Right now it's twenty fifteen. No, late tw late twenty twelve. I joined in late twenty twelve. Um and then I started doing videos. I think I actually started doing videos like near right away because I remember I, I had videos up there. Yeah, on my previous account on MKB Hacker Chaos, I had previous videos up um, when I just had like my first, my first few, first few armors and helmets like my Vogue Cub Coat, the Chirvimus Buster, stuff like that. Like the really ancient things like before revives and missions were even existing, before battle pets existed, like before all of that. Like, yeah, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm an ancient player. Um, next, really, nigga? Junjigo, Junjigo SK says, Wanna buy Barberstorm Blade, ASI High, 9.5 KE. This guy is advertising on my freaking... Bro. Bro, you, that's not cool. You don't just do... Okay, you know what? If you sell anything off of my thread, you're paying me, like, a 10% cut, okay? So if you make 9.5 K, you're sending me 950, alright? Thank you very much. Great, awesome. So next, we got... Robert Shin. Oh, I know this question. Can you beat Voxter in lockdown? Mm. Damn. I want. I want to get cocky, bro. But yes, I think I can beat Voxter in lockdown. And I, I, I already asked him to one v one me, and it's not like he, he didn't really pussy away and say no. I just he doesn't play SK as much. So even if I managed to beat him, it's not like he was in as much shape as he was like before, right? So. I mean, still, when I get back on SK and I start practicing again, I'll definitely ask him, like, yo, just for the guys, they want to see it. Like, you want to get some 1v1s going on. So, you know what? Um, I'll, I'll put a comment down here. I'll message him and be like, yeah, when I'm back, I want 1v1 you. Because I definitely think I can beat Boxer. Um, if he doesn't use Shock. Um, one of the terms I would say is no status at all. Um, yeah, no status. Just playing, you know, Prisma Driver, Umbra Driver, Valiance, or the new Elemental, slash Piercing, slash Shadow Valiances. Those those kind of weapons, you know, that along that kind of line, I can beat them. So I don't want to like have like stun or shock in the factory because then that kind of takes away from it. So yeah, what what's the girl email? Oh yeah, a freaking project. But anyways, next, um, Nate Wom Nate Wabamba. Not even a question, but sorry, my phone screen is small, so my typing is horrible. Okay, that's great. Maybe if you like shrink your hands next time to like put them too long in the dryer or something like that, maybe it'll be a bit smaller and it'll help you out with your typing. Just a suggestion. Next, Monster High Vlogs and more says, Do you have PS4? If you do, add me at the boss 67F. 67F, are you a little granny who likes trolling little black guys in the middle of the night on Call of Duty? Cause I am not down with that. Uh uh. No, 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 thank you very much. I'm just joking. Um, I don't have a PS4 though. I wish I did. If I did, I probably wouldn't even be on PC though. But PC's life. PC just wrecks PS4, Xbox One, Xbox Two, Xbox Seven. It, it, it wrecks everything. Yo, PC is like, um, so sorry. I don't, I don't fuck with no PS4. Like, I don't even know how to play PS4, man. Like, I remember, 
And this guy, he had a PS4, man. I'm here, like, pressing, like, square and circle. I'm like, bro, wh wh where am I right now? I'm, like, in the PS4 home screen. And it's like, what the hell is this? You got, like, a video section here, music section here. Yeah, I understand, but, like, the X, the circle. Like, no, I grew up on Xbox, bro. Gears of War, yo, Max Payne, Fable. Those games, I grew up on those games. So, no, no PS4. Screw PlayStation. I'm, I'm all about that Microsoft and Xbox life. I'm sorry. Um... But the graphics on PS4 just absolutely blow the Xbox out of the water. That's that's for sure. That's no doubt. Um, so that's all the questions on my Q and A video. Now let me go onto my page and look for my my um previous post. Um, yeah, this is gonna be way back. Damn, how far back is this gonna be? Oh shit, let me. Oh no, this is gonna be way back. Oh no, let's see, let's see, okay. Woo, this is gonna be way back in my feed. Damn, I'm here going on my Facebook. So you know what, for you guys out there, if you wanna look me up right now, um my name on Facebook is Nat McLegan. Um N A T space M C L E G G O N. It's not my full name, my full name's Nathaniel, but yeah, I mean you guys can just add me up on Facebook if you want, like I'm I'm cool with it. If you guys start bugging or being annoying or one else block you like that's why i roll haha <laughs> nah but anyways scrolling scrolling so i know people here ask me questions man they ask me enough questions like free i i want to find these i'm actually gonna find whoa 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 where are they okay scroll down i'm gonna find it hey i found it okay okay Okay, who's the who's the boss? So, as you guys can see here, um, I don't know if it shows that well, cause it's all light and whatnot. But if it doesn't adjust or focus, 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 focus. Um, yeah. So I said doing all, doing a Q and A YouTube video, just comment slash inbox any questions you want to ask, and I'll reply in the video. Troll slash serious, etc. I don't care. It's good to have a mix, but nothing too fucked up, please. That's exactly what I said. I promised my subscribers it would would have been up like a month or two ago and I forgot doing it tonight and that was on April 4th today is April 6th so I kind of lied about doing it tonight I did it next night but anyways point is I'm getting to it now love you guys first off what hair products do you use I use head and shoulders man head and shoulders you gotta keep your hair just nice and luscious you know just flowing in the wind everywhere um yeah cause I use head and shoulders no it's exactly how it is next Mohammed Abdi is this tea popping? Yeah. Oh man, this tea though. Oh man, this tea just. Oh man. You know what? If, if pussy was drinkable, that's what my tea would be. It's that good. Next question. Lexington, aka Grimjow Lessethin Her. What the fuck is your name, bro? Grimjow Lessethin Hikragia. All right, I got it. Oh, better do mine. Do you like black women? Oh my god. I can't lie, I love me some dark girls, I love me some chocolate, mm, I love that chocolate, but, damn, someone could be so damn bitchy, man, oh my god, it's like, one, if you don't get home by like 7 o'clock at night, they gonna be like, where you been, let me see your phone, let me see your Twitter, what is her name, why do you smell like perfume, like, yo, they'll be giving you all them questions, yo, and oh my gosh, oh my gosh, the hair, the hair, bro, yo, you be banging on the bed and whatnot, you grab her hair, all that, you know what I'm saying? Next thing you know, her hair flies out. Like, bro, like, her, her hair will be in your head. Oh, my gosh, bro. Like, y'all gotta stop using that fake leaf stuff, man. Like, even if you use, like, relaxer or whatnot, that's I. Right. Even though it might hurt your hair over time. But, girls, what's up with the weaves that not even stayed in? Like, if you're gonna get a weave, make sure it's in there properly, bro. These black girls, you don't know how many times I'll be banging a black girl and her hair just comes out. Like, no, it's supposed to stay in, my nigga, stay in. So, in, in general, I like black girls, but... It's not something I really want to stay long term with if they don't keep themselves proper, you know? <laughs> oh, I'm just I'm just messing around with you. Anyways, next question. Oh, Muhammad said, you a real nigga if you say this tea is popping. This tea is popping. This tea is popping. This tea is popping and locking. It's jocking. It's shocking. Even though these niggas be flocking and they be talking. Oh, anyways, next. Um, Vicky is like, A, hey, you better say my question. What is your question? Vicky Williams. Oh no 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 no. Oh no. Oh my god. Why do thoughts smell like fish? How okay, okay, hold up, hold up. Look at the variety here. We go from my YouTube video. 
which is clean, all up to, do you like black women, and why do thoughts smell like fish? And is this, and, and, and is, how is this tea going? Like, bro, my Facebook and my YouTube are like on a different level of social, and a different level of reality here. Um, but to answer a question, why do thoughts smell like fish? Well, first off, if you, if you think about it, um, most of the time thoughts are like, you know, like low-life girls who just go out and pretty much have sex with every other guy, right? So that means that they're going to be sweaty, they're going to be stinky and whatnot, just like a fish. Meaning, that is the relation. Like, that's why thoughts smell like fish, because they're always sweaty and whatnot. Because they thought they'd be sucking too much dick, pretty much, all the time, you know? They'd be tasting other man's babies in their throat. <coughs> I saw that from Shaggy still. Um, next question, Shay Alcina, do you eat booty leg groceries? Oh, no, bro, I, I never ate the booty before. No, man, no, 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 no. I don't eat the booty leg groceries. I don't eat the booty like groceries, but you gotta eat the booty like groceries. How it's supposed to be. Oh, uh, anyways, no, I don't eat the booty like groceries. It's, it's just not right. Um, it, it, that's what that's where that shit comes out, man. You don't you don't put your face in there, man. I can give you some Ebola. No, nah, man. No, 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 no. All right, but wait, where'd the where'd the comment go? Where 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 they at? No, no for real. Did I, did I just delete my own post? Oh, alright. Next question. Oh, last question. Muhammad Abdi, is the cake a lie? No, the cake is not a lie. You know why the cake is not a lie? Because I have a cake right over there. Um, and it's not a lie, meaning that the cake is not a lie. Um, I don't know how else to answer that question, to be honest, but... I think... I think I gave a good answer. Um... Let's see. Let's see, guys. And that's the last question. So, yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out any other videos on my channel. Of course, they're kind of old, but I will definitely be going up there um, and uploading a lot more once I get my computer built. I'm getting that job at Home Depot, though. Uh, gotta be gotta be building shit and directing people where to buy their plants because I'll be working at the garden section. But anyways, <laughs> yeah, as I said, again, like, comment, subscribe, share the video with your friends. Do all that stuff, leave your comments below in the description, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out, YouTubers. Oh my god.